Welcome to Vital Source Content Studio, the digital authoring tool that makes it easy to develop beautiful interactive learning content. This short video will show you how to create folders and screens, add static and interactive content, and build, preview, and publish your EPUB to Bookshelf. So let's get to it. Go to vcs.vitalsource.com and sign in with your username and password. Let's open a project called Anatomy Titles and add content to the digestive system. First, create a new folder by clicking the Add button, then Add Folder. Folders are a great way to organize your content. Let's name this folder Chapter 1. Next, add a screen. Think of a screen like an interactive page where you can add text, images, video, learning activities, and more. Give your screen a name. Then click Add. Back on the content screen, click Open. Let's start by creating something simple like a heading. Click Add Block. And then under Content Blocks, click Heading. Type your heading. And click Done. Excellent! Now let's add another block of content. How about some text? Just position the pointer under the block you just created and the Add Block button will appear. Click the plus sign, then click Text and start typing. It's easy to format text, add links, even include definitions. When you're finished, click Done. How does it look? Oops, I think I spotted a typo in the second sentence. Let's fix that. Just click in the box, click Edit, make the correction, and click Done. Adding interactive elements is just as easy. Let's include a short video on this screen. First, add a new block. Then, go to Interactive Blocks. Click Video. Browse and upload a video to your media library. Perfect! Now select your video, preview it, and add a description. You can also include accessibility features like closed captions and a transcript. When you're finished, click Done. Before we go any further, let's check to see what your screen looks like in different formats. Click Preview, and you'll see how the screen appears on a desktop, a tablet, even a mobile device. Nice job! Once you're done adding, reviewing, and editing content, it's time to build your EPUB. To get started, let's go to the Content screen. Click the Export tab, and then Create New Build. During the build, we check your files for any problems or errors. When the build is successful, you can download and use it in any EPUB 3 compliant reader or preview your EPUB in Bookshelf. Let's see what it looks like in Bookshelf. Once your content is finalized and approved, you're ready to publish. Just click Publish to Bookshelf and your content is now live and available in the Vital Source Bookshelf e-reader. Thanks for watching and thanks for choosing VCS to author and produce your digital learning content.